tonight we are at the House of Sadness, a location that Selby thought to be haunted by the previous owners of Anne and Simon, though the true nature of the spirit here remains a mystery. came back out of the other room to see that this bird has been moved none of us kicked it at all like we uh, uh, what the fuck that loud bang well, upstairs all up oh my god right next to you man he is standing right next to you yeah what the hell thank you no it just came into the room I'll be honest, I really don't like the vibe of that room. I swear a noise and there was like a click right yeah. by my ear. Alright, so Andy, thank you so much for getting us in here. Yeah, no worries. Um, it's a really sad place, to be honest, isn't it? You know, just, just looking at it. Um, yeah. Every belonging left behind. You know, so I'm just gonna have a look at the kitchen a minute. Um... See, this is what weirds me out. Yeah, it's just so. I mean, there's even surreal. There's even leftover food in the freezer. Lot, you know, it's. Oh yeah. Some vintage brown sauce. You pointed that out earlier, didn't you? Yeah. Um, I mean, it's this. Oh God. You know. Yeah, it it literally is how it was when she passed left. I mean minus whatever got destroyed in time. But it is it is a very eerie feeling being in this house. Uh Becky, is that her her room up ahead? Yeah. Uh show me around. See, this is way, I mean, this is when it hits you real, you guys. Uh, I mean, everything, just still here. Stuff, toys, medication. What the hell's happened there? All that dirt is coming through the fireplace? Yeah. A lot of glasses there. So, just out of curiosity, uh, a little bit of experiences here. What sort of activity have you had happen here? Uh, uh, we, we come here with the next team that were part of it. And, yeah. Um, we got what, you know, we thought what Anne and Simon communicating about K2s. Yeah. Um, especially in the other room near the chairs, the, the answers on them were absolutely phenomenal, weren't they? Uh, yeah. we, we've been here uh, recently, and again, the K2. Absolutely. They love the K2s yeah. here, don't they? Yeah. Um, okay. So, yeah, uh, we, we've never had sort of a um, pod go off in this place, but it's a challenge, and I'm hoping we get that tonight. Most definitely. Now, do you want to explain what we noticed with that dead bird in the other room? Yeah, there's a, there's a rather fresh dead mm. bird on the floor. Let's actually there? go look at it real quick, yeah. because this is what's odd. Uh, you may have already heard me mention this, I'm not sure, but I was filming this bird, right, when we first got in here. Uh, I was using it just to get some establishing shots. Came back out of the other room to see that this bird has been moved. None of us kicked it. At all. Like, we would have known if we had it, kicked it, it. It was more like there, weren't it? Yeah. You know, we had a pile of feathers and now it's like... Yeah. Yeah. That's what's <laughs> really odd. Um, literally must have happened a minute or two after I took a shot of that. It went from there. To there when we came back into the room, so I'm quite curious if anything else it's might move. Definitely not alive. No, it's not alive. Uh, I think it's pretty clear to see. Uh, all right, well, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and get started on this investigation. 
Um, we will do a bunch of lights out, uh, just full blown paranormal investigating and see if this house is truly as active as I believe that it may very well be. I mean, I just get a weird vibe in here. Like yeah. when we were standing in the other room, uh -huh. lights out and I had to, you know, I was walking yeah, out yeah. here with no lights. It just felt like something was watching you. Yeah. You know? I should try calling out real quick, probably for Simon and Anne, as the spirit here likes to claim that that is who they are. Maybe jump for a second, I just heard a shuffle behind me as soon as that light turned off. Simon, Anne, are you around? Could you say your name if you're here? Oh, it's so dark in here. Simon! Are you here? this real quick if we can all right I'm gonna turn the light off I could have sworn I heard a knocking noise come in here come from in here if you're in here could you make a noise can you knock on something I know there's raindrops there. And could have very well have just been the raindrops. Yeah. I don't know. Um, let's try something else then. Uh, all that. What the fuck? That loud bang? Loud upstairs, all that. I don't know. That was very boomy. Yeah. Hello? Can you make that noise again? See, throughout the night we keep hearing these like taps or bangs. It sounds like it's coming from upstairs sometimes, but that one was kind of reverbed in this room. Oh my stomach. Uh Simon or Anne or any spirit that's here. Could you please just make a knocking noise or a banging noise to let us know you're still here? Tell you what, since Andy, you have a uh, you and Becky have more experience in this home. Uh, let's go back to home base over there. I'll take the camera and I want to see you guys ask out. Okay. See what we can get. Are we recording yet? 
Yeah, and I just caught an orb. Really? Right next to you. I shit you not. So, are you feeling comfortable to come over and say hello? I told you we'd come back and see you, didn't I? Oh my god. Right next to you, man. He is standing right next to you. Yeah? What the hell? Thank you. No, it just came into the room. It just came into the room and disappeared. It floated there right in front of you like it was looking at you. Yeah. For a good, like, five seconds and then just walked into the room. Wow. It's in here with us right now. So do you think you can do something for us? Can you come and have a chat on these bears that we've got on the floor? There's one next to me and there's one near Becky. All you need to do is go up to them and touch them. And they'll light up and make a little noise and then we can have a little chat on them. But yeah, we told you we'd be coming back to see you, didn't we? You guys want to try asking if it'll show itself again? It did twice. Yeah. Um, so we think we think that you've just shown yourself on camera. Would you be able to do it again for us? You can walk straight past me again if if that's what you want to do. Are you getting any feelings over there? Yeah, loads. What are you feeling? Just that, you know, that like sort of. Oh, it showed us. Oh God, it's right there. It's right there. Oh my God. It it showed itself right in front of you. Thank you. That's three times now. That's absolutely amazing. You're doing really well. What the hell? That's awesome. Thank you so much. I also want to say thank you. I know it's my first time here. Yeah, this this is Andrew, by the way. He's one of our friends. We told him all about you. Did you just hear two taps behind me? Or was that just me? <coughs> Maybe I was hearing things. Sound like two little taps right behind me. Would you like us to come into the living room where the chairs are? If you'd like us to come in there, can you make a sound for us so we know? I heard that. I heard that. That was loud. Wow, you know what that sounded like? What? Like a cabinet door opening or something to got that squeak and then that like latchy sound. You heard a squeak? What did you wait, what did you hear? Just like the banging noise. Kind yeah, of I heard like a very loud tap. Yeah. Yeah, but they were like they're like you know like when a rusty cabinet squeaks when it shuts. Yeah. And then latch. That's what you heard? Yeah. Uh I couldn't hear it from here. I hope camera picked it up. Right, so I think we have to come in here then, have we? Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm going to bring REM pod bear in. I have to bring other REM. Uh, yeah, you might as well. Oh, you have to see this footage. When we're done, man. Is it amazing? Huge. One of them literally just hung out next to you for like yeah. a good 10 seconds. I can't wait to see it. Alright, so I'm running a digital recorder for EVPs while Annie and Becky are going to ask out, see if we can communicate with the spirit that we just captured on camera. So, you two. I'm, I'm saying two because I know there's two, two different spirits here. 
Are you going to come and have a chat to us? Last time we was here, you spoke mine and Becky's name. Can you ever go at that again? What is that squeaky noise? I heard that then. That's like a second time I've heard it. What is that squeaky noise? I heard that then. What is that squeaky noise? I heard that then. Start. We'll do a very, very quick spirit box up in here and then we'll call out. Simon or Anne, any spirits around here? You've shown yourself already to us tonight. Could you speak with us? Oh, I'm covered in chills now. My guns just hit really hard. If you're in here with us, could you say hello to us, please? Concentrating on little like light static flashes, I'm getting on that landing. Oh, okay. You know, just visual. Are you out on the landing? Could you say the word landing if that's where you are right now? Please don't be afraid to communicate with us. If you're claiming to be Anne, could you just say the name Anne one more time for me, please? standing on the other side of the landing in this room in the pitch black we'll see if anything happens if we'll, we'll see if anything happens I guess I've separated myself from the other two I'm in this room can you come and talk to the red light in my hand To be honest, I don't like the vibe I get behind me at all. Are you in this room with me? Can you make a noise? Fuck. Heard a noise right there. Was that you? Can you make that noise again? I'll be honest, I really don't like the vibe of that room. And I swear noise and there was like a click right yeah. by my ear. Uh, we'll review this real quick. I separated myself from the other two. I'm in this room.
That's. Can you make a noise? It's like a whisper. And I react. Yeah? Instantly after. It just sounds like it goes. No. Alright, it's quick. Yeah, like yeah. I ask if it make a noise, it goes. And then I hear, like, the noise, and I react to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking weird. I really don't like that room. <laughs> I really don't like that room. <laughs> right, so the REM pod bears started going off since we left the upstairs. Hello. Who said that bear again for us, please? Crap, it's like as soon as I come around the corner... I'm happy that you decided to have a little play on it. Well, thank you for setting it off. You set it off so I know that you're still here. So after an absolutely fantastic night in a very mysterious, eerie, but oddly peaceful house, um, I can say we've definitely caught quite a good amount of evidence on camera, and I look forward to seeing what else there is. Uh, I do want to thank Andy and Becky of uh, Phantoms Paranormal. Uh, be sure to subscribe to them on YouTube. Uh, I only support 100% real channels, and these guys are absolutely fantastic. Uh, you guys, how did you actually feel about tonight? Yeah, to be honest, uh, you know, when you told me about um, light anomalies that come up near me, I, I was like, whoa, you know, I can't wait to see them. Mm -hmm. I can't wait yeah. to see it, but, mm -hmm. you know, that's that's when it all popped with that one, and it, you know, I, but other than that, I, I love this house. You know, it's it is labelled house sadness, but it, it is peaceful. It's like, yeah, you know, it's it is, it. yeah. Much agreed. It's a great place, and uh, no, you guys, I'm sure, I'm sure they'll be back again. Uh, who knows? I might come back someday too. But until then, as always, we'll end, as we always do. Do you believe yet? Say it. Do you believe yet? There you go. <laughs> Subscribe to Fandos Paranormal. Catch you next time.